and in tennis Wimbledon has had its fair share of characters down the years. There's John McEnroe of course or you might remember Jeff Tarango who was so upset he walked off court. Well the latest bad boy is Australia's Nick Kyrgios. He beat the number four seed Stefanos Tsitsipas in a match that was far from good natured. With that and the rest of the action here's Tim Ullman. Look up fiery in the dictionary and you'll probably see a photo from this match. Two players who, despite once being doubles partners, clearly don't always get along. Things seem to turn a little sour when the Greek player hit a ball into the crowd, nearly striking a spectator. The Australian insisted his opponent should default the match and made his opinion clear, loudly and repeatedly, to the umpire. It's constant bullying. That's what he does. He bullies his opponents. He was probably a bully at school himself. He has some good traits in, in his character as well, but when he, uh, he also has a very evil side to him. Kyrgios continued to berate the officials in a match described as being like a circus, but in the end he won it in four sets. I don't know what to say. I'm not sure how I bullied him. I, I was, he was the one hitting balls at me. He was the one that hit a spectator. He was the one that smacked it out of the stadium. I didn't do anything. I was actually like, apart from me just going back and forth to the umpire for a bit, I did nothing towards Stefanos today that was disrespectful. Elsewhere, Rafael Nadal booked his place in the second week of the tournament, beating Italy's Lorenzo Sonego in straight sets. There was a big upset in the women's draw. World number one Iga Swantek saw her 37 match winning streak come to a close. Frances Alize Cornet beat her 6 4, 6 2. The 32 year old said she was like a good wine that has aged well. For the first time ever, Sunday will see scheduled play at Wimbledon. The centre court marks its centenary. History is always being made round here. Tim Ullman, BBC News.